Okay, so this is the best way I can describe why focusing on race when things like this happen, when people like Mr. Floyd are so carelessly taken out of the world, why focusing on race instead of the person or the persons that perpetrated the crime, why focusing on race does not work. So this is society. Here we have a couple of people. This is our society. These are a couple of people. And uh, let's say these are everybody that's upset right now in Minneapolis, okay? They're upset. They need answers. We've got a few of them. They're going out and doing very, very bad things. We've got some of them sitting home doing very, very good things. We've got some that are just confused. But they're all looking for guidance, okay? The rest of these Cheerios are the laws, mandates, communication dialogue that we can have that are going to create positive things. These are all positive little Cheerios that are going to fall in everybody's lives and create positive things that come from Mr. Floyd's death, right? As we can see right now, right now, society, we're talking about all, everything, it's wide open discussions. All the tidbits go straight to the people. All the information goes straight to the people. What happens when we put the blanket or the umbrella of race over the topic? Ain't nobody getting crap. We have blocked the tidbits of knowledge because now we're screening them ineffectively. We've got to talk about this like the problem it is. It's a person problem. We can talk about culture, race, and all these other things later down the line. But to correct this, we've got to correct the person problem. Best, best way I can describe it.